Welcome. We are still in, in vector. We are still in vector product. And under vector product, we'll be talking about dot product. Let's go. And dot product is still the same thing almost as multiplication. But then, there's one or two things um, about stuff we need to do. And if you have a vector, A is equal to 5i minus 4g plus 3k. And uh, B is equal to 7i plus 2g minus 8k. Now, A dot B, we have done it before. A dot B, that is dot product. It's equal to 5 times 7 plus minus 4 times 2 plus 3 times minus 8. And that will give you 35 minus 8 minus 24. And this will give you 35 minus 32. And this will give you an answer of 3. And... Uh, Another example for dot product, of course, we may have something like this, that A is equal to 5i minus 4g, and then B is equal to 7i plus 8g. And, um, and you have C, you have C to be equal to 3i minus 2g. Now, and I ask you to calculate A dot B plus C. So practically first, you need to calculate or B plus C. And uh, you will now pull them together and get your dot product. And so B plus C, B plus C should give you, so B plus C is this plus this, three, 7 by plus 3i should give you 10i. And then 8j plus minus um, 2j to give you plus 6j. Now, this will not be a dot this. And then that means is your a is 5i minus 4j all in bracket of 10i plus 6j. So this will give you, this time this will give you 50. Right? Yes. Is it not? Yes. Good. And then minus 4j times 6j will give you what? Minus what? 24. So this should give you an answer of 26. So basically, that is all there is much to dot product on the primary level. We are going to proceed the one that is more hectic, but it's not going to be on this video itself.